Every game has cheaters. And as we all know, Dead by Daylight is no exception. But I'm not all that interested in the super obvious ones. What I find fascinating are the subtle cheaters. You know, the ones that seem just a tad too fast. Or the ones that always know how much distance they need to avoid a hit. The ones that continuously gaslight you because they bring perks that may be the reason as to why you question their speed in the first place. Well, personally, I think those types of cheaters are the worst kind. And what's even more scary is they're becoming more prominent. For today's video, I wanted to show you a game where some weird stuff happened. And but it was so subtle, I just couldn't be sure. So I had to call in a favor from a professional. And ultimately, you be the judge down in the comments. Enjoy. Oh, I didn't want this one. I didn't mean this one. Oh, God. Okay. Looks like uh, got a joy. Very fun. So instead of being able to carry 10 hatchets, our base kit, our, ba our base hatchet carrying will always be seven. It can never be increased. Literally ever. A little bit closer. Oh, there's three here. Okay, so now I'm moving at 115. I mean, it's 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 decent, I guess. Like it allows you to kind of close a little bit of distance, not by much. Then I slow back down immediately. Why is this guy so fast? Less than three SLZ. I, I know I only threw one. Day. Me? Was that just me? Bizarre. Sizzock, Sizzock, Sizzock. Some couple of more months ago. Thank you so much. In a wooden clog. In a wooden clog. Yeah, that guy was uh interesting. We'll have to investigate that further. I see now. So I mean, ideally, like, do I want to like? Hmm. Would I want to try to essentially? Use this and then just follow up with a mouse one. Ideally, would that make more sense? Potentially, we gotta reload anyway. Thank you. Thanks for reminding me. I kind of, I kind of want to just chase that guy again. Now, now I'm interested. Look at him. That's the guy, right? This is him. Maybe he had, did, did he have sprinters or something? Maybe. This, win this window is going to be atrocious. Let's see how long it takes for me to get him. I'm genuinely curious. Right, now, and keep in mind, I'm getting batteries included from the gen inside. I'm 115. Now I'm faster. It's cheating. Isn't he? Is he? Is he? Interesting specimen. The shack stuff was that was that was the first thing. That was the first thing that was kind of iffy. You know what I mean? It was the shack. I only pulled one hatchet. Of course, I slowed down and I missed. But that was weird. Maybe we're okay overthinking it. Maybe. Maybe. I want to chase him again though. Batteries included, plus the haste from the hatchets. And I couldn't catch them there. Oh, 
dares enter my den? I need to get him on open water. That's the only way. Switching? I don't know. I want him to get picked up. I want to see it again. I, I want to. I want to get him like out, out of this building. All batteries included right here. All this is. So I'm 115. Bloodlust. I'm bra he's breaking chase with me. He's breaking chase with bloodlust and uh Maybe he's walling too? I mean, it's not like the most unironic thing ever. This is Bloodlust 1. Bloodlust 2. Hope he didn't have hope in the first chase of the game. That's when I, that's when I first saw it. So th that's the kind of like if, if he's the kind of guy that's gonna run perks that make you second guess your fucking sanity by going, oh he had hope. Maybe that makes sense. But it was the first chase where I was like, whoa, that's kind of weird. All cheaters use hyper focus because they are fucking stupid idiots. Uh, respectfully, if you're a cheater and you don't run hyper focus, congratulations. That's like the <laughs> that's like the bare minimum of like. Hmm. Am I aware that, 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 that I am perceived this way? Basically, what I've just done is all I've done is hold W. You could have mind game me three times already and got hit. Sure. He, and he, listen, the way, the way you play DBD, right, is, is come, come here, come here. This is, this is how you play, come to this corner. I would stand here until I see you come around that corner. I do not run this way until I see you coming around right. that corner. The amount of times you came around that corner and he was already all the way gone, Meaning you could have literally doubled back mm -hmm. right here and gone through Shaq instead. But he, right. he does this, not even looking behind him, running to the corner. It doesn't, it doesn't make any sense to me. This is, so this would be if, if I'm using check spots. So I'd hold it here. Right. And then I wait. And then you're following me. Okay, I can see you. That's fine. But look how much faster you catch up now. Right. I already have to use pallet. You see? Right. And this is normal. That's, that's normal Shaq. I would get around one loop. And then you'd have to throw the pallet down. He vaulted the window when you were standing here. Right. That's not how this works. You don't, I don't like, you, you ready? This is, this is when I vault. Go, go back, go, go back into the building and I'll show you when, when you vault this window. Go, come in now. Come in. There, this is when, that's when you vault. Right. And it's a fast vault. You don't, you don't slow vault this. Mm. And you see how much, like how much less distance he would have had if, if this was the case. Okay. So let's see. It was like, it was like right here. You were like that close and yeah. he made it back to the pallet. Yeah. 
I mean, come on. Like, you you were. Like, 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 like do the exact distance you were from the pallet and tell me when to go. We should go back on the VOD and, and check that, actually. Because I'm pretty sure he did that to you, like, two or three times. Wait, let me go back to it. You see? I'm like so slow now. Like when you look at me well, compared to his speed let's, there. Let's do this. I'm going to hit you just right here at the rock and then I'm going yeah, yeah. to I'm gonna replicate the double back. Ready? Here you go. <laughs> yep. And then he runs this twice. Runs this twice. With perfect pathing. I'll run with perfect pathing. I won't mess anything up. I mean, you're dead. I can hit you right here. Yeah, no. Like there's, there's just no way. All right. Yeah, I got shitty. <laughs> I mean, come on, dude. Like this is, this is normal speed, bro. This is normal speed. I'm not. I don't have MFT on, dude. I don't have a base get MFT. Yeah, yeah, just play. Just play the shark. Play the shark. All right. No bam. Play ball. Is he just you, you can just do this? And you'll you'll never catch up. You'll never kill me. You'll never catch up. And nothing will ever happen. I can infinitely vault this window as many times as I want. And you'll never catch up. This is just a complete infinite. Ah. Wow. Yeah, I'm getting no, no, I'm not even in chase. Nothing's happening. No, you'll never enter chase. Because I'll just keep letting go of shift on this corner here. You'll never see me sprint and you'll never enter chase. Wow. I have to double back to the window. All right. You see, and now I can't do it anymore. Uh, no, I'm not even in chase. I'm not in chase. You see? No, 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 but that's, you, you would catch up because I had to stop walking, you see? Right, right, yeah, 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 I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. Like, I, I would have to run. When I run and you see me running, that enters chase. So, like, a lot of, so Trapper 1v1s, I don't know if you know about the DBD League ladder 1v1s. Trapper 1v1s is just bloodlust management. So when you play against the Trapper, he plays no traps, you're essentially playing to avoid him ever getting bloodlust. Does wow. that make sense? Yeah, yeah, So you walk, you walk everywhere. Like, you walk around corners, you never enter chase. So, like, I would basically play this to never enter chase with you. If I enter chase, then I have to get to a pallet that's safe, throw it, break your bloodlust again, and then do the same again. And just make sure you never get bloodlust two or three, because that's when an injury happens. The moment you get bloodlust two or three, that's it. You're hit. Right. And then it's same again and same again. Ah. Wow. And they, they get two hits that way.